Bangladesh is experiencing flooding. The waters are rising um, on the delta and the waters are melting from the Himalayas. A young architect from Bangladesh, Mohammed Raswan, didn't want to design buildings that were going to be underwater. He worked with local boat builders to modify um, these traditional boats and created one and two tiered floating schools, clinics, three tiered floating farms, clustered housing where people actually share uh, communal areas. In response, to the rising waters. I think this is a really important uh, approach. It's the way people are adapting to their particular uh, geography and what's happening with the changes in the climate. This is the, the one-tier model. You have the solar uh, panels on top. The energy from the sun is gathered on the solar panels and then they uh, recharge lanterns. These are the actual lanterns that they use. And these are kerosene lanterns that are modified for solar uh, use. I think this is a direction design is moving in, working with local vernacular design and architecture, along with leapfrog technologies like solar energy systems and uh, combining those two together.